That's it. I can't stand it anymore. I said I can't stand it anymore. Alice, Sophie, are you listening to me? Huh? You were saying something? Yes, I said that I can't stand it anymore. You know, this, this whole situation. Today, for example, I've just given a lecture on history of art to the third year students. And I asked them who Salvador Dali was. You know what they answered? What? Well, having more here this long, anything is possible. Really? For me, this was the straw that broke the camel's back. They thought that the Lee was some kind of a doctor. Yeah, makes sense. <sighs> do you know what? You're right. We must do something. But something like what? Something, something exciting, something big, something that will make people realize how important art is. You know, I don't know if I'm going to be able to take any more of these kind of answers. What's next? Mago is a plumber? I can't believe it! Again! Oh, Someone has stolen my bike! Again! I was just having a coffee from the machine and all of a sudden, I can't believe it! It was gone! Vanished! Oh no! I love that bicycle! It's a one. It looks so cute! Well, I have to go. I have to give a lecture. More torture! What are you doing here? Um, I work here. Uh, right. Uh, you know, I, I was just wondering whether... So, you got them? I don't know, I haven't slept for three nights, you know, I've been so worried, I thought that might be something in the newspapers. All this for nothing? <sighs> I got it. We're stealing from the library, and what is the library made of? Uh, books! I give up. We should have moved to France when we were young, before getting into teaching. I could have lived quite happily there, like those women of the Latin Quarter. What are you saying? That's not the point. We became teachers because we believe in art. Because we want our students to realize how important it is in our lives. Because we want society to be aware of it. An appreciation of art begins in school, with teachers, precisely. Yes, you're right, Chloe. Let's teach this university a lesson. An art lesson! Good afternoon and thank you for coming to our press conference today. I'm afraid that at some time yesterday evening, the entire supply of coffee at the university was replaced with paint and the, the university cannot deal with such an unexpected event that has astounded everybody here. Something like this was not included in the budget. Um, are there any questions? Yes. Do you know anything about whom I have committed such an atrocity? 
Well, we can definitely say that they do like coffee. Should people be afraid of them? Unfortunately, yes. They have stolen all the coffee from the university. They may well come back for the milk and the sugar. By the way, don't you have anything to say about the book that was also stolen from the library? Book? What book? We're here to talk about important things. Coffee! Sick of the, who, uh, sick of other people don't want to appreciate art, and I think it is a good idea because we have had a great time with fu funny bloopers and moments with all the actors and people, and I hope you like it. Well, I play the role of Chris in the in the film. I am the director assistant and I also carry the microphone. <laughs> I think that uh, making a film is a good experience for all of us uh, because you have to look for different locations, uh, look for the uh, customs and paintings to, to create the perfect atmosphere for the film. And it's a very funny film and we enjoy it. Did you like this idea or what's the purpose of making a short film? Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, At first no, like, but now I like it and enjoy it. It's funny. Yeah, it's funny. Yes. But I, as you wanted, I wanted to make a, a documentary. Yes, about Logroño and Yes, but now I like yeah. this idea. Yeah. Now we can see the whole idea of the project, so it's easy to understand and to laugh. And okay. It was funny to prepare it because yeah. they're, uh, I don't know, working with, with the group and they're trying to, to say your lines and you're always laughing because you find it funny and you have never done it before. So I think this is a good experience. Yeah, I, mean, I totally agree with my classmates and friends. I can't believe it! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You're so funny. <laughs> <laughs> um, I want to point out that uh -huh. even though the whole film is really comical yeah. and funny, there is kind of a great thing in the film. This is like this protest against people that don't um, really realize about how important it is art in our lives. So, um, I think my character has a very important role in this sense. And I don't know, I think that's that's most that I can say. Well, for me, 
it has been very strange to <coughs> give life to a character that I have created myself. Mm -hmm. And we at first thought of my character being silly, and then here I am, uh, being <laughs> me and her, but I don't know, it's a challenge, you know? Well, I've been the camera operator and I've been recording all the all the shots, all the scenes, and it had, it uh, was a, a hard work, but a very interesting one uh, because I've learned how to use the camera and how to move through the scenery, and it was very good and very good. So this morning we were doing some shooting uh, and this morning was a lot of fun, however it was very hot, it was a lovely day here in Spain. Well for me anyway we don't get good weather in Ireland, so Alvaro, what do you think? Yes, we were recording for a while, it took, it took at least two hours in order to... Um, yeah, do one scene. Really. Yeah, yeah, it was a, only one scene. a very short scene and I think it, it was it, it it used to work. It was worth doing so, and, but Catherine was starring, so what, <laughs> was the, what does the thing about all of this? I didn't want to act, so um, I don't know, but everybody more or less has a part except Jonathan here who's doing the making of. Yeah. But um, yes, yeah, so I have a part and I try to do my best. We'll see how it turns out. Mm. Hopefully it's funny. Once people laugh, I don't mind. The second time I'm not the director and I rather prefer it this way because otherwise it's too much of a burden for, for the teacher and you cannot get so much uh, in relation to what the students are doing and you are more worried about the thing rather than about the students. So in this, I think Throughout this process, we have been able to develop the, the film more than, at, at least as far as uh, rehearsals are concerned. That's all, friends. <laughs>